Marcus loses patches. Marcus loses patches. Hi, I'm Marcus, and I love to play video games so much, so that my mom thinks I am hooked on them. She might right. I do spend an awful lot of time playing them. Marcus, will you fetch Portis, please? That's my mom, and Portis is my dog. I'm right in the middle of this awesome game, where I have of. I'm right in the middle of this awesome game, where I have to find my way through an Egyptian pyramid. I'll get past the fins. And then I'll feed Portis. Just a minute, Mom. All right, but don't forget. I need to the cas casserole out of the oven for lunch. Mom said this game is really difficult. I'll try getting to the omelet from the lens. One more time, then I feed my favorite candy. K nine. K nine. Forty five minutes and several dry, dry later, I hear mom again. Marcus, come to eat. Perfect timing, man. Was that hardcore? I'm wet out from. Dueling the two headed links to save the magic amulet. I go to the table, and Mom asks if I fed Portis. Goop! I'm in big trouble. I got so into my game that I forgot about my dog. I bet Portis is stirring by now. I know I am, Mom. I forgot. I'll I'll fix her now. I go to the backyard to bring Portis in, but I can't find her. She's not lying under her fire shade tree. She is not watching our neighbors walk by through the gate. Wait. The gate is open. Oh no! Purchase is gone, lost. Now where to be found? I must have left the gate unlocked when I took her out this morning. I'm in even bigger trouble now. I hear mom making telephone calls, trying to locate. Porches. From what I can hear, it sounds like no one has seen her, uh, and I'm worried. I know what I'll do. I'll make signs so people can can contact us if they see Porches. Then I'll go look for her. Mom helps me make signs, even though. She still disappointed in me for being so irresponsible. Irres, ir, i, res, res, bon, simple. Irresponsible is responsible. When finished, when we finish the signs, we walk around the neighborhood to hang them up. We go to the park to see if Portis is there. My friend Thomas is playing soccer in the park, so I ask Thomas if he seen Portis. He says he hasn't. My stomach grows loudly as we leave to look elsewhere. I haven't eaten any lunch. Mom asks if I'm okay. I tell her I want to keep looking for Portis. I'm really worried now. We visit our after 
moving house up to house, asking neighbors, neighbors if they have seen porches. Nobody has. We are almost to my grandma's house, grandpa's house, a few blocks from our place. I'm really hungry. Maybe he will have a snack. I would use a hook too. It doesn't seem like we will ever find porches. When I get to Grandpa Barkyard, Grandpa asks me what happened. I tell him how how I accident Charlie, accident Charlie, left the barkyard gate open and how porches got out. Properly, properly looking for food. Can you explain how you forgot to feed her? Grandpa asked. I start playing one of my fav, my video games, and I couldn't get past this part one. When I realized, Partes was gone. I was so worried. How would a video go? Game be more important than the dog, than your dog, Grandpa asks. It's not, I say. I'm happy. Parties is safe. I feel awful that my dog would have gotten hurt because of me. I walk over to Mom and Parties. I'm sorry. Mom, I'm sorry I didn't listen to you. I'm sorry I made you worry. And Portis, I'm sorry I forgot about you. Thank you for your apology, Marcus. Says Mom, let's go home and eat. I'm sure I still forget to do things sometimes. I do love my video games. But I love my mom, my grandpa, and my dog even more.